from their spokespersons. Let me tell you what Obasan just said about the structure these people have. He said, Atiku Abubaka is a man that has propensity for corruption, tendency to disloyalty, inability to say and speak the truth at all times. He says, a man who has propensity for poor judgment, belief and reliance in matter about, lack of transparency. Hello guys, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Well, welcome to this YouTube channel. If you're the first time you see this channel, make enough you to hit on the red subscribe button. If you don't subscribe before, thank you and God bless you. And if you're the first time you see this Facebook page, speak in this blog, make enough you to like and follow this page for more videos of to come your way. My people, more than I think when I try to watch this video, but as you watch them, they make enough you to share. Yeah, from our popular Nollywood actor, we be our spokesperson. Who be this one? Kenneth Okonkwo. I beg, take your time, watch this video. No fear to share. Share, listen, share and make others listen to which Kenneth Okonkwo. He give out to APC and PDP. Woto, woto. Yes, now. He said, if they know, see, they're bold, they're strong, when they call Stan Peter Obi. If they know, see, they are. I beg him, top my mouth, don't want to hear this story finish. Watch this video, and as you do watch it, take your time to share and make all that listen to you. Now watch and make obedient. I know you don't need to watch things alone. We they share, so share it out. Make others watch with you. As you do, so God bless you. Guys, watch this video, then we'll come back to put our own take. Share and more. See you guys here. Questions. Maybe they are living in another planet. Certainly not in West Africa. And certainly not in Nigeria. Because he's very cogitating. What you have presently is one state police, one national police, no state police, state, I mean, as in Nigeria. So we put up the creating uh, three levels police. of policing, federal, state, and community. He already used it as a number of state governor. Under that which law? Will he be able to achieve that? No. The law exists, section 11 of the constitution too, that gives you the power as a state to use the resources you have to protect your state. Good. But it does not have the power of the police. That is why whatever you're doing, you're still going to do it under the approval, consent of the police. If you arrest, you take to the police. And that is why there is no prosecution of criminals, bandits and terrorists. How many have been convicted? Under his regime, three levels policing is going to restructure, is going to re-equip He's going to retreat. These are users. He's going these to are frequently used language. Yes. That we are now very, very uh, used to in the country. And these are the questions. Right. Nigerians want specific good restructure. What good. is restructuring? That's what I'm How saying. How will it come Three by? Three levels policy. It is How not, will it happen? It will happen by effectively mm -hmm. amending the constitution and removing that word, one police. You have to do it. Mm -hmm. And that is one I'm of his own agenda. You're a, you're a lawyer. Oh, yes. And so you understand what is very well. But, um, uh, border adjustment, local government creation, yes. um, even state creation, you know just how almost impossible yes. that our laws has made the adjustment and the review and the amendment of that <laughs> to happen in this country. So the yes. question is these are things that are in, in the eighth, in the seventh, in the ninth National Assembly. They've tried to amend, but it has never come through. Because there is no sincerity of purpose. Would you give such an amendment to a Tinubu that does not believe in structuring or state police that is not even stated in his manifesto? You think it will work? No. Dictators like to operate outside the state apparatus to achieve what they want. Let me tell you, our problem in Nigeria is not the scarcity of good governance plans, ideas, and policies. No, we are not buried of that. You're here and you know about 2020 vision. These are no. What we lack is a combination. What we have is a combination of institutional weaknesses and lack of political will. That is why my principal is offering a new brand of leadership that is transformative, that is responsive, that is responsible and less transactional. So what we are looking for now is that president who will go in with executive orders. You can achieve the security. What is Amotekun asking for? For powerful weapons to be able to engage the terrorists who have superior weapons over them. Why should the federal government not grant them? Under existing laws already. So there's no political will. So what he is saying, he's going to offer that brand of new leadership. And let me tell you, he talked about destroying the structure of criminality. 
and you and I know that these parties have been talking about structures. They have structures. And the structure they have, as you can see, the PDP and the APC, I said they should go into competition to know who failed more. What APC is talking about PDP is absolutely correct. What PDP is talking about APC is absolutely correct. What APC is talking about itself is absolutely a lie. What PDP is talking about itself is absolutely a lie. Now, you can see I'm surprised and shocked and embarrassed by the lies that are oozing out from their spokespersons. Let me tell you what Obasan just said about the structure these people have. He said, Atiku Abubaka is a man that has propensity for corruption, tendency to disloyalty, inability to say and speak the truth at all times. He says, a man who has propensity for poor judgment, they live and reliance in Mara about, lack of transparency, a man who trusts in money to buy his way out in all situations, a man who has the readiness to sacrifice morality, integrity, propriety, truth, national interest for self and selfish interest. We are seeing it manifesting. You could see in that tape you are talking about Michael Achimugu. It was the voice of Atiku Abubaka. And they have admitted it by saying they want to leave it to concentrate on their campaign. It's denied that that but, is not the voice of Atiku no. Abubaka. When you deny, you go to court and sue the person for libel, for defamation, for slander. In the absence of that, that is an admission. It's not Atiku Abubaka. So that what you said is actually an admission. Because he said, no, we want to leave it. The, the man has dared them. The Achimugu. He said, I dared them to say I did not serve Atiku. And I will bring more records. What did Atiku say? It gives me goose pimples that Atiku has the national award in corrupting the generation before him and corrupting the generation after him. He said in that tape, I have advised Obasanjo against open corruption, meaning Atiku has been operating coded corruption, sacrificing innocent people and hiding his own head. Joshua Dariye was sacrificed. In that same tape, you're talking about marine floats. As the company that Atiku advised his boss that they should form marine float as a company that they will use to siphon the money that they will pay consultancy fee non-existent to such company. These are just use it these, are, these are allegations they, based on the on the tape released by, by Michael, Michael Achibo. So which that voice yeah. is in my own opinion, yeah, Atiku's voice. Okay. I'm glad and that you are able to uh, put in the right language. Opinion. Yeah, we'll put it in the right language. Clear. What about Tinubu's daughter that carried 10 million naira? Allegedly. Openly. No, it has been brought out. The, 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 the politician. Openly in front of her. Thanking her. Saying he took only 1 million naira. Cash. Where is money laundering? She should be languishing in jail. Huh. That is the same reason that Doi no Kupe was brought to justice. Collecting cash. Section 2.1 of the Money Laundering Act. If you make or receive in cash an individual right. any amount exceeding 5 million naira, he she should be in jail. And what about the spokesperson of APC? Festus Kayomo. He's a minister, serving minister. His person, his time has been fully paid. He's on full-time employment. And he's using himself as a resource to campaign for a political party. That is corruption. He's using the resource of Nigeria to campaign for a political party. Using the money he's been paid to campaign for a political party. That is sharing the money. He's been paid for full time as a minister. And he is there talking about another party. Are we not ashamed in this country? APC and PDP, like I said, the monster with two heads. PD, APC. APG and PDP. The Tinubu and Atiku, they are equal and opposite. Okay. One is a Milokon of the North. Another one is a Milokon of the South. Let, let's anchor I on don't this. know. Two of them should step down. Yeah. I've said this thing before. Now, on a final note, because we are out of time. Mr. Okonkwo. I mean, just... Out. Okay, guys. Now, watch this video finish now. <laughs> See, I don't get much to say, but all the way I know be saying, Tinubu and Atiku, 
You see this set of people where they be Omila and they don't feel they don't feel both fully. So I will advise Nigerians where they support Nibu and Atiku. No one and get sense. When I hear Peter Obi, he say he go destroy all those structures of criminality. He go bring them to book. He go bring them down. So when I wear they support Nibu, I get listen on no one go jail. When I wear they support Atiku, I get listen on no one go jail. So when I use when I talk, eh, take out my teeth where. I just my case say I beg. Please help me to share this video. Eh, hey, can you to cook one? I was spoke person. God will bless you. You see how Peter Obi spoke person, eh? All of to get brain. Your brain, eh? In the make t t t t t. It not be bola babala blue, blue blue, taho in the blue. No, not be all those kind of blue we get. We get intellectual people where they talk where. Guys, I heard my video here. I beg, eh? I borrow this word, taho in bola babala blue, blue blue. Eh? I rest my case. See you guys in my next video. Stay safe, guys, and bye bye.